Hi guys, welcome to Cheryl's Home Cooking. Welcome to Cheryl's Home Cooking and today what I'm going to show you is my chicken chili. So let's get started. To make my chicken chili I have two cans of cannelloni beans which is a 15 ounce can and I rinsed and drained. I also have one 10 ounce can of diced tomatoes and green chili. I have eight chicken tenders that I diced. I have one tablespoon of dried oregano one teaspoon of ground cumin and a couple pinches of the cayenne pepper I also have two garlic cloves that I diced and one large onion so what I'm going to do is place my chicken in the frying pan and I'll brown up my chicken then I'll add in my onions and my garlic I'll also be placing everything in my Dutch oven which is a Marquette Dutch oven so I place my chicken in my frying pan I have a little bit of oil I also salt and peppered it. I'll put my oven on 350. I'll leave the link below in the description box on where you can get your Marquette Dutch oven. I just love this. In a few minutes I'll add in my onions and garlic. Now I'll add in my onions. Stir it around. I'll get my garlic. Stir that around. I'll give it a few minutes until the onions are a little bit soft. You can see some of the chickens lately browned. So now I'll turn my burner off and I'll add this into my Dutch oven. So now that I have my chicken, my onions, and my garlic in my Dutch oven, I'll add the rest of the ingredients. The two cans of cannelloni beans, which was the 15 ounce cans. I'll place that in. I have my tablespoon of oregano, the teaspoon of cumin, and a couple pinches of the cayenne pepper. I'll add that in. Now for my liquid, I have 32 ounces of the chicken broth, so I'll pour this in my Dutch oven. Okay. 
I'll stir it around. So now I'll add in my 10 ounce canned diced tomatoes and green chili. I'll mix that around. See how quick and easy this was to make this chicken chili? So now I'll let this bake in my oven for about 30 to 40 minutes. So into the oven it goes. So now it's in my oven and I'll bake it for about 30 to 40 minutes on 350. I'm going to check on my chili. See how it's doing. Ooh, that looks good. I'll take a little of the broth and add some cornstarch to thicken it up a little bit. I have a half a cup of the broth. I'll put in a half a teaspoon of the cornstarch. I'll mix it around. Then I'll add this back into my Marquette Dutch oven. I'll pour it in. Stir it around. and put the lid back on. And back into the oven it goes. I'm going to take the chicken chili out of the oven. It's been 40 minutes. Now I'll take my lid off. Doesn't that look good? I'll stir it around. I'll put a little in my bowl to try it. I'll put the lid back on. You can see all the spices, the chicken, the tomatoes the cannelloni beans. So now I'm going to give it a try. So I have some of the tomato, cannelloni beans, and the chicken. This is piping hot because I just took it out of the oven. Mmm! Tastes really good. I think I'll take another bite. This was really good and delicious. It was quick and easy to make too. And I love using that Marquette Dutch oven. Well, thanks so much for tuning in to another episode of Cheryl's Home Cooking and watch me make my chicken chili. Give it a try. I'll see you guys next video. Bye-bye.